my brain is still trying to compute everything that we just, you know, saw. I mean, it's just, this, this um, you know, all I wanted to get to with this video, you know, I'm not, this isn't going to be like some deep analysis of what we just saw in terms of Hyrule Warriors or Hyrule Warriors, um, you know, the content, or anything like that. Um... You know, we, we've all played a lot of video games. You know, I, I keep saying I've, I've played a lot of video games. And it's, you know, just this, this thought just came to me. That this, with Hyrule Warriors and Breath of the Wild, and we know the sequel is coming. I'm going to tell you right now. I think this could arguably be one of, if not the best trilogies ever made. Because this, this is what this series is going to be this this breath of the wild series is going to be is it is seemingly going to be a trilogy we have the main game the main story we have a prequel now with um Hyrule warriors age of calamity and then we're going to get the sequel the, the the continuation of the main game with breath of the wild 2 or whatever they decide to call it i don't think they'll call it breath of the wild 2 it'll it'll, it'll be it'll be something else but either way, this is a trilogy of games all focusing on the same characters, the same stories, interlapping, overlapping, and just merging with each other to create this one whole Zelda universe unlike we have ever had before in the Zelda series. I mean, we've, we, we've had Zelda games that have had, you know, sequels, you know, I, I, you know, I say with, with, with quotations, you know, um, where we've had just the same Link or the same characters carry it over into a different game. You have to follow up to the game. We know it's the same character, but then for the most part, the story is completely different. You know, so whether you look at the original Zelda and then you know um, and the, the, the second Zelda game on on, on the NES, um, or where you got like Link to the Past on the SNES, and then it's it's the same Link that you have in um, Link's Awakening. Um, you know, that you got Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask. You know, we we we've had all these these Zelda games that continue with the same character, move it over, but we've never truly had um, a Zelda game, uh, you know, a main game and a sequel so intricately linked to each other. And we're not just getting one or two games; we're getting three games, all based around the same story, but from diff completely different angles, which is just absolutely phenomenal and i am i'm just 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 excitement wise i'm just i'm just like oh my god this is because we just breath of the wild i've i've, I've said before it's it's my it's now my favorite game ever and nothing's changed i've i'm i'm, I'm i've played it so many times now over over the three years since it's been out nothing has changed and and you know, to, to, to see what they're doing with, with Hyrule Warriors, I think it's clear now, just, just based off this gameplay, that yeah, it's a it doesn't even feel like a Warriors game, which is, which is mental, right? Because it is a Warriors game. But just the way it looks and and how we can tell now how deep the cutscenes are, are connected in, it's just, you know, my God, there's, there was a one shot with um, Ubosa on top of um, um, her Divine Beast looking over just a scorched battlefield with hundreds of guardians flying and, and ground-based ones just just heading it and it just blew my mind the scale of story and combat and battle that nintendo are going for with this game absolutely blew my mind it's just like beyond your wildest dreams i'm, I'm trying to i try to think of trilogies of games that i have played that i can say these are the best trilogies ever made um, the first one that comes to mind is is the Metroid Prime trilogy. You know, of of course, I, I I probably consider it to be arguably the best trilogy of games ever made. Just just each game fundamentally is just phenomenal, absolutely phenomenal. Um, you know, I can think of other stuff like Mass Effect. Um, I love the Mass Effect trilogy. You know, beyond beyond most games, absolutely love it. Um, it's got its problems, but still, you know, it's, 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 it's up there, man, up there. I mean, what else have we got? You know, we, we, you could say, like, the original Super Mario games on, on the NES, Mario Bros. 1, 2, and 3. Um, hell, you could mention F-Zero, you know, as, as mainline console games, you know, from, from the, uh, the SNES to the N64 um, to the GameCube. Um, all three phenomenal games for each of their consoles. Um, I mean, we're getting Bayonetta. Bayonetta 1 and 2 are just incredible. Absolutely incredible. And a third game could lifted up there without a doubt and I, I think it will 
you know, Bayonetta 1, 2, and 3 could be one of the best trilogies ever made. Um, I mean, even if I said Shemu, Shemu 1 and 2, I, I rank up there, it's just oh, phenomenal. But then you've got Shemu 3, Mario Galaxy 1 and 2, is somehow we get a Mario Galaxy 3, could be up there, you know, for sure. The Zelda, oof. Um, but, you know, this, this Breath of the Wild, it's, it's the Breath of the Wild trilogy. And it's just, it's so, so exciting. <laughs> I had goosebumps. Just like I had when I, when I first saw that last Zelda trailer. Uh, which I still say is the greatest trailer ever made. Um, I had goosebumps down my arms. Um, tingles down, you know, down my spine. Just, just, it was just, oh man. This is going to be the best trilogy um, ever made, I feel. Because I got, I got no fears whatsoever about Breath of the Wild 2. You know, you, you can call Hyrule Warriors Breath of the Wild 2 if you want. I, I, I don't care. It doesn't matter to me. Um, you know, and this, then the, the next game that's coming out, we can call Breath of the Wild 3. You know, I, I don't care. Um, but I got no fear about it. Passing, surpassing the first Breath of the Wild game. Absolutely no fear about it whatsoever. And just saying that alone... To say that this next Zelda game that we're going to be getting after Breath of the Wild, after Age of Calamity, this next one that we're getting, I truly believe that it's just going to blow Breath of the Wild out of the water. Which is mental. Because just think about what Breath of the Wild is. Just think about what it is as, as a game, as an accomplishment, as a, as a, as a template for what you, what you want to see in video game design, world design. Just <sighs> this trilogy is going to be immense, and to think this game's out in November, I just, I just, man, look at me, I'm, I'm, lo I'm lost for words. You know, I'm, I can normally just turn this microphone on and waffle away, but I'm just, I'm just, I'm just lost for words. It looks stunning. I mean, just, just when you're going through. Um, Castle Town and stuff. I mean, that's that's the greatest um, Zelda Castle Town we have ever seen. And even though we're not going to be going there buying buying potions and stuff, you know, from from NPCs and stuff, just just the way it looked and everything that they've incorporated, you know, the trees being chopped down and all that stuff, you know, it's just um, just the character designs, that the quality of 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 the of the presentation. It looks like Breath of the Wild, but just, just better. And this, this is what the next Breath of the Wild is going to look like. I have no fear about that whatsoever. No fears about that whatsoever. Um, and it's, 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 it's not a, it's not a graphical thing. It's a, it's a beautiful thing. Because that's what Breath of the Wild done to you. You know, the. I was playing it the other day and I, I tweeted it. You can still just stop and stare at the sunset. And it'll just blow your mind. Blow your mind. You just stop and stare at it. And it's just... You'll watch the grass sway after it's rained. You know, the way the grass is glistening as the sun shines off it. It's just... It's just a beautiful, beautiful world. Beautiful game. And then just seeing this age of calamity how things are going to be devastated these characters you know that you've you know that you've um, grown attached to it's going to be a harrowing experience and even that unto itself is a beautiful thing an absolutely beautiful thing and it's just going to be an absolute experience to experience all of that so um yeah, you know those are, you know those are just my quick thoughts and reactions on, on um, Age of Calamity. I cannot wait to play this game. It's not even just, just just as a Warriors game. It's just going to be great fun. I mean, we saw input and stuff. She looks, you know, uh, just I, you know we all. I'm sure many people thought, went, well, you know, she looks higher, <laughs> you know, uh, but obviously you know it's, it's the young input, um, stunning character design. This is what Breath of the Wild has as well. Absolutely. Stunning character design, absolutely phenomenal character design, and you know you you can see the Nintendo effect on this game compared to Hyrule Warriors. 
the first one. You know, compared to the first one, you know, like you know, like Anuma said, you know, before when he first saw the first Hyrule Warriors, he said he was so impressed with the cutscenes and the combat and stuff, it without a doubt affected the development of um, your know, Breath of the Wild and how where you know they want to go with the series and stuff. Just think about what you're seeing now with Age of Calamity. And then put even more aspects of this into the sequel to Breath of the Wild. The follow-up to Breath of the Wild. It's just... I'm, I'm, I'm shaking. <laughs> I'm shaking. Just, um... Oh, man. This is going to be the best trilogy um, I've ever played. I can't think of anything else. I can't think of anything else. Outside the Metro Prime. Outside of a possible Half-Life 3 somehow coming along and working miracles. I um I can't think of anything else. But yeah. <laughs> Let me know your thoughts, people, just just in general. Whether, you know, trilogies, Age of Calamity, Breath of the Wild as a trilogy. Breath of the Wild, whatever. Let's talk Zelda. Let's talk trilogies, and let's just bask in the excitement that video games can bring to us from a story level point of view, from a visual point of view, from an interactive point of view, just just from everything that that we as 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 uh, humans love, just just beauty. <laughs> Absolutely beauty. Yeah. Let me know your thoughts, people. Thanks for listening. And as always, take care all. Peace. Oh, and um, if you do like my content, <laughs> give this video a like for me. And if you're interested, su subscribe. <laughs> it's very rare that I say that. <laughs> but yeah. Thanks for listening. Take care all. Peace. Out of respect for our princess, you may keep your lives. Now go! Huh.